Whose freaking idea was it a podcast during an Arctic blast? Dude, they said it was fine now. We do it for the people. No wonder. <laughs> the, 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 the people. Dude, no, no wonder Panda Express was closed. <laughs> Everything closed at like I, five today. I couldn't even get mad. I was like, damn, they care about their employees. <laughs> 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 but I'm hungry. <laughs> Yo. They're, well, the, they're the essential workers. Yeah, yeah, right well, well, this is essential work. Podcasting. Welcome back to the Unqualified Gurus Podcast, the hardest working podcast on this side of. Uh, but yo, while others cancel, hey, we're still here. We're still here. But there's like snow outside of uh outside the room. But mm-hmm. you know what? You're a doctor, construction doctor. You didn't have like any medicine to help for the cold or anything like that. Yeah, they got these little potions that I found. Oh, Guess so. Damn, we're drinking so early in the day. Why, why does he have a little skull? It's called Jager. <laughs> Jager Meister. A Jager Meister. Th- these things do not look like shots, Rick. This looks like a freaking whole ass drink. What's going on? So is this supposed to like warm us up? I, I that was supposed it's to like be tequila. Syrup. I that was supposed to be. Oh. Smell it. Do we chug it? It's like Nike. I think drink a couple of them and it'll have the same effects. So you put your. We're sneak. supposed to shake it first. <laughs> Is oh man, this, mm. this smells I'm like I'm freaking Nicole. scared. Mm. Didn't we talk about this one time? Because I remember oh. this logo in, in this we podcast. Can, we can do. We can do half. I've can talked about it. how it's my favorite logo out of a lot okay, of companies. Maybe, th- maybe that's what we, it was. We can do half and then really? the other half. Well, Across well, on we, top we, of a deer. Yeah, it looks really cool. Well, to warm up, let's go. Para arriba, para abajo, para el centro, para dentro. Para el frío. Oh my god, I drank all of it. <laughs> yeah, I did too. We were supposed to. Oh, well, well, we said half. It did half, but it, w- it went down so smoothly. It's not. It's not a. It's now not we, like the last shot we had the other week. Over now there, now we need some Red Bull to chase us down. Ooh, baby! You know the um, the. You think that's true. No, I was about to say, the whole drink tequila to warm you up. It's it's all lies. It's you all sure? yeah yeah. I think I it's know. scientifically. Wait, but but well, okay, no. <laughs> scientifically. No, no, wait, wait, but but there is the science as far as temperature goes. But then there is like yeah, the experience, it's, ju- it's just feeling. a placebo. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I w- I always think of the movie it about the kid who t- yells at his mom. It's like it's just a gazebo. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I, I can I can never take the word placebo serious ever again after that movie. Well, I mean, it's a placebo. Yeah. Well, I guess it's it's not hot, right? So yeah, no, like th- it's not like if you drink a coffee or a champurrado or. Yeah, and alcohol thins your blood too. So just by you, you don't want thinner, faster moving. Well, I mean, right. if you, the Red Bull will get your heart rate up, will we'll get your, the blood flowing faster. So maybe if you drank a Red Bull with the uh, Jaeger, well, you, you probably get warmer. I'm I'm probably one of the guys that uh, the placebo gazebo uh, <laughs> effects because I I do feel warmed up after a shot. You know? Yeah. Yeah, right now yeah, I. F- Danny, I don't know. Almost that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right now I feel like like our grandparents used to be like I used to like walk two miles to get to school, hike through the desert, you know, like climb a pyramid, like zip tied zip what what's a <laughs> zip line zip down, line. just to did make they, it to school. When when they had like Arctic blasts, did they get a, did they how how did they because uh, right now we get the iris alert or whatever. That's just like, oh, it, there's so-and-so bridge that's frozen. Like, there's a weather. Iris alert? I think that's what it's called. I think any alert. Oh, I got it for, I think it's tied to my job. Mm. Oh, that's and it cool. it gives us a. Like well, I mean, a back up. in the day, you just see the migration of the mammoths. They're going <laughs> south. <laughs> it's like, oh, the winter's coming. Ma- 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 I don't think mammoths would be the ones leaving. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. All of them. <laughs> well, if they went south, you know it's yeah, getting cold. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Makes sense. That's when you know you have to cancel the pod yeah, for that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that point is like everybody leave your leave your spears behind. We're leaving. <laughs> yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are here, and it's all for you, the, the lowly viewers, the listeners, the the patreons, the, the patreons, the gurus, our supporters. This this is for Esteban. Live, laugh, love. <laughs> we're watching. Uh, we're watching Thanks. wrestling, and uh, there's a guy that isn't a part of the. That oh, well, we had the wrestling uh, guru here. I'm gonna ask him next time he comes. But there's a faction of the wrestling group. Yeah. That they're called the Judgment Day. That's a Rey Mysterio son. Yes. So they're all like mean. <laughs> I pretend to know stuff. You they're, know. <laughs> they're, they're all like mean, and they're judgment. Like there's reckoning, and and they're all evil and stuff. And there's one guy that he wants to be a part of it, but he's like super friendly and like <laughs> he's like I've always been a part of the group, and he photoshops himself like in all the previous pictures <laughs> and stuff. And uh, like I, I said, like Judgment Day is like really dark, and he says, uh, 
he says, well, like the judgment day always says. He put a, like the what Joker? the Joker said. <laughs> he was like, what the judgment day always said. Live, laugh, and love. <laughs> and it's like, what the hell? They're supposed to be really dark and he's saying that. So that, yeah. that's for Esteban. Esteban. <laughs> Yeah, look, look look at these freaking wrestling dorks finding ways to bring up topics like that yeah. into the podcast. Yeah. Yo, the wrestling guru's gone, bro. It's Dude, over. We need to talk about real stuff. Like, yeah. we have a Jager, whatever. Meister. In, in speaking Mister. of in the speaking of Jager, Jager speaking of Jager, Attack on Titan's over. Earn Jager is over. Oscar, you you actually went to go watch it. Yep, I, 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 I can it. see why you struggled to say the word. Well, it's because I couldn't even tell if that well, was. Well, us a alcoholics, <laughs> we've known it yeah. like, before. We we were even oh, legal right. enough to drink. Yeah, yeah but but speaking about Jaeger, Erin Jaeger. Okay, so for the long okay, look from nerdy topic to nerdy topic. I'm That's sp- what I meant. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, I did finally finish the Attack on Titan, and like I think I told you, I I, I think I gave it a fair score. I think I gave it like an eight out of ten overall right. for yeah, the you for gave the show. It yeah, I honestly feel the the very last battle was so anticlimactic. The with the big um, when, when they fought. No, so the the worm part was cool. I okay. liked I liked all that lead up. But the first episode, I the think what was part? Solid. The first the first half of the of the last two part. Mm-hmm. I think the first half was good. I liked the fight on the worm. I think or the first half of the second part or whatever. You mean no? You it's like, hard. To, it's hard to wait. keep up because there was like parts. the last <laughs> chapter or the last uh, part, but it had like five or six chapters, so it would go through like a thirty minutes. And then it would be like yeah. chapter one. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then it would go 30 minutes. But w- when you say the worm, are you talking about when they're fighting on, on his back? Yeah. No, I was talking about the last fight when they're trying to hold the worm back. Oh, yeah, that's the part I'm talking about. Okay. Well, because, you know, they're just trying to get to Aaron and how quick all that happens. Right. It's like the biggest moment. And I don't feel like that cutscene wherever, like, obviously, this is spoilers. We're sorry. Uh, oh, we gave you enough time. I mean, it's been out for... Half a year already? Yeah, it's, it's been, been a while for a while. I, now. I know, but right, right now everyone's mad at Usher because Usher spoiled the end of Jujutsu Kaisen. And they're like, out of everybody. Well, good thing to I don't spoil. know who Usher is. Because yeah. I'm yeah, about yeah, to yeah, jump yeah. on it. You know, yeah, you know, wait, no, I'm just kidding. It was a joke. Danny, do you know uh, who Usher is? No, I know who Usher is. Look up, he look, says, yeah. Look, look, up, look up Usher cosplay. No, because I'm going to watch it. Oh, oh, he. Relax. We're not going to watch the video where he, he uh, yeah, cosplay. ruins it, right? No, no. No, it's just the uh, the. He's just right, right there. You see, he's dressed up as Gojo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so it. Uh, I was like, look for 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 everything that's happened. That's cool. I like I like how popular anime is. That's dope. But in his caption, he's all like, he says, he yeah, yeah, it. like <laughs> he spoils it for everyone. And they're like, out of everybody in the world, I thought it was gonna spoil the ending for me. It would have never been Usher. <laughs> have you ever spoiled something like yes. me terribly? Just to someone with, I mean, I guess I, not I, on purpose. I, I I did it on purpose, though. Oh, you did it. On purpose. I did it on purpose, but I didn't wow, do it to. Monster. I didn't do it to everybody. Like Shut I did up, it. Bitch. I did it to uh, my friend Vic. You need to leave. My my friend <laughs> my friend Vic would always do it to us, and oh, it would piss okay. me off because I'm like, oh, you motherfucker. That, that, that's good. And then I finally <laughs> I finally watched one that uh, he didn't watch, and at the end I fucking recorded. It. I'm like, fuck that motherfucker. And I recorded it so he can watch it, and he was all pissed off. But I didn't post it like online. I didn't put you it on my- it directly. <laughs> he, on the other hand, watched the movie and posted it like on Snapchat. So I'm like, okay, what the fuck? Mm. And I, I knew he was watching it, but at the bottom had the caption, and it, I was like, ah, oh, fuck. Sometimes whenever the words are in front of you, you read it, and it fucked me up. So what did he spoil for you? Yeah, I think it was. Uh, I think it was the first. Part of the uh, Marvel from the Infinity Wars. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, I was and whenever he snaps his fingers, yeah. But what, what, what were you spoiled about that part? Well, I hadn't seen it, and oh. then I think on the second one, I think he took a video where like Scarlett uh, Johansson when she dies, I was like, "You motherfucker, you're two for two. <laughs> and then like, for what? Two. Did, what did I ruin? <laughs> I don't remember what I ruined, but yeah, he was he was mad. Oh well, I, I well. Whenever you put it that way, he deserved it. Yeah, yeah. But back to Attack on Titan. Yeah, um, I, I I just think that the very moment, the very last moment, just felt like it was just like, well, how are we gonna introduce these flashbacks? That's that was my biggest gripe too. I felt like the the flashbacks and the Aaron talking to the different people were kind of like, 
at weird times, yeah. and sometimes I even got confused. I was like, they were they really screwed he, it up. Yeah, well, I did enjoy seeing like those talks and seeing like I like, enjoy like, the talks, like but it, like there was like I think there was a talk with him and Mikasa, and it looks like he's telling her like we can go together, mm -hmm. but then there's another talk that he's doing with Aaron, where he's saying you know this has to happen and I need to die, and then it's like okay, so in one conversation you're saying you know we can live together and just go away, and the other conversation you're saying. I should die because that's the only way. And so maybe he did that on purpose because he would think that Mikasa wouldn't do that. But it just kind of confused me. No, like, I, I think it's different. I think he was playing out like the fantasy with Mikasa. Probably. Because like Probably. like on the moments that he's talking to to Aaron. Aaron what's his name? Was it the other one? Aaron? No, the other one. Uh, the, the the blonde Armin. kid. Armin. Oh, Armin. Names, names I, keep so close Aaron. Together. Yeah. I keep saying Aaron. I keep saying Aaron. Yeah, Armin. Armin, like, you know, he, he actually, like, finally lets it out that he, he, right. he wants to be with Mikasa. Right. You know, so that that's... I, I, I can see that, but I don't think it's, like, clear. And I, I think all of this would have been fixed, and I go back to it, is that they were under pressure, and they started... Putting chapter one, chapter two, the final, final season. Like, I don't think they were under pressure for anything. I think it was just a money no, grab. No, because people, people, people were like, well, this is fucking sucks. Like, they lost a lot of people because of it, you know? So I think if they really so. would have played it, it the out. the biggest thing of the year. They, they really did fuck it up. I don't, I don't I think, think so. I, I was, I, I'm sorry, but like, like whenever you, you pay attention to like the freaking people online who love anime and stuff. Mm -hmm. I don't think anybody was. Well, I remember on the podcast well, I showed where the fucking like, Crunchyroll was. was it crashed, yeah, yeah it because crashed. Yeah. everybody was fucking. I mean, I, I think they fucked up in naming it that, but I also, I do, yeah. I just think that they just played it wrong. I think they were trying yeah. to hype it like, oh, this is the last one. Mm -hmm. No, there's more. It's like, <laughs> what are you doing? Don't. Yeah. Don't oh, do but wait, wait. I, I, I have a point to, to like the how you're talking about how the flashbacks don't make sense. Remember, they, they say that it's over a period of time. They 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 just didn't do a good job showcasing that. Yeah. But yeah. they 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 explain how he had talked to them way before. Right. And but he like after he erased, he erased their, their memory. Yeah. And, and after, so but after dies. after everything happens, it's supposed to come back all at right. once. Yeah. Yeah. It, I'm just saying yeah. like they it, it's not him. super clear. Yeah. Because they forgave him like after after they actually kill him, they're like oh like fucking yeah. That's why Mikasa did, takes his body, a, right? Yeah. He did have a fucking plan. Yeah. Yeah. Well, but at the time they were upset because they were like fuck, this is the only way. Uh, well, well, Rick, Rick just spoiled it for for those of you who didn't. That was the that was the the thing that was spoiled to me. Like I saw the last panel of Mikasa holding his head. Right. Yeah. So like I already knew that he, mm -hmm. that she was gonna kill him. Yeah. So I just didn't know how because I was like I my, was already mad. My uh, my wife. I watched it with my wife, my sister, and uh, my sister in law. And um, did you cry? Oh, there was there was there were some tear jerker moments, dude. Yeah, I think I think your Which sister one? cried too. Which the, one? I don't think I felt like teary on Attack on Titan. The uh, what was her name? The one with the uh, Hanji. Oh, okay. That was okay. that was really yeah, sad. Yeah. yeah. But, but was that, that on the last? The Hanji is the one with the. She the has an eye patch. patch at she the was end. the one oh, in that was charge. On, that was on the first part. Yeah, that was on the first. That part. one. That one yeah, was really sad. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. fuck. And then that made you cry. There was a, also a part where uh, Levi is seeing like everybody that, uh, that it part. was like fuck. Yeah, I, 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 like, I think that one was a little more emotional for me. And he saw like his in the very first because I rewatched everything. I had forgot about it because I told my uh, I told everybody like, hey, rank the deaths like which one like hurt the most, you know? And then they were talking about it, and I was like, well, I just recently watched it, so I remember. Yeah. But uh, Levi was had a, had a girlfriend on the first squad in oh, the very yeah. first season. And people like forgot about I her forgot because about she her. died so quick, and it was yeah. like, but that was Levi's like. Yeah, I forgot about her too. It was I remember like, you were telling me about it. I yeah, forgot. Yeah, it was it was fucking sad. Yeah. So for the next next homework is Cyberpunk. Yo. So uh, one question. So given given how the show, like you know, the first two seasons, you you kind of have this theme about them being stuck in this place. Yeah. And they're like being attacked by titans and they're trying to figure out what are these things and then on the second two seasons it changes to like oh we're, we're actually the titans and we're actually at war with others who are using our own people against them. like there is such a big like change in like the what to expect from the story i'm, I'm, I'm not like i i love that i love you finding like there, that i don't think there was just like, at any point where you're like well i know what's gonna happen yeah it and, it wasn't. And, if, and, and if you watch it like from the beginning there's so many fucking hints, right now. Because now, now you yeah. Because now, now, now I know, yeah. and there's so yeah. many hints, and you're like, "What the fuck?" Yeah, no, that, that revelation was huge. It's just like, have you ever watched the the movie The Village? 
Is it the one with the with they're trying to leave and then get to uh, the? It's about a girl who who lives in like an old time. Like, yeah, like it, they it don't want to like, expose to civilization. Yeah, yeah, yeah but she's okay. blind. Right. Oh, she's blind. She's, I remember she's, that part. She's, I, I, I is it a scary sure. movie? I think it's like a thriller. Yeah. yeah. Can you look it up to make sure that that's, that's the name of it? I think I think no, it's it is because yeah. Yeah, and like it's like it's like a like it's like a scary movie, but the entire the entire thing is just about them like not wanting her to escape. And like whenever you find out, you know, the truth, you realize that, you know, like it, they live in the real daytime, you know, they just don't want to be part of society. Yeah. So they scare people so they don't go out. Yeah. Yeah. But the entire, the entire movie, you're, you're, well, that, you're yeah, still and, thinking and that that's a badass, uh, the guy that did the movie, right? What? Who? He has a whole bunch of oh, fucking yeah, like, yeah, yeah. crazy M. movies. M. Night Shyamalan. Yeah. 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 Is he, is he Shutter Island? He 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 also did the uh, movie where they're they're like aging and shit. Oh yeah, yeah. The beach one. He, he had a couple of them. Yeah, yeah. The the beach one pissed me off a lot because it seems like it's something that would happen. It's because it's just the greedy pharmaceutical companies. Yeah, that that, that guy has really good uh, really good movies that are like they have twist. Yeah, uh, it should say. I think he also didn't he do the uh, no that's Martin Scorsese, no that's another big yeah. one yeah no never Did, mind didn't he also do the uh, what am I blanking out the Life of Pi, I didn't watch that one you didn't watch it that no. was actually really good did you watch that one then I it, watched it it, it looked it look cringy I don't as hell. I don't think I really enjoyed it it wasn't bad <laughs> I, 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 it had I good it. it had cool effects and like the story was kind of interesting but uh. I honestly forgot like everything about it, other than there's a tiger on the boat. But like, I, like it, yeah, it, that, that is very important information. <laughs> like, now, now I might want to watch it. <laughs> there's a tiger on the boat. They become friends. Um, but yeah, um, yeah. So well, well, I, I guess let us know when you watch Cyberpunk. The the, the other, uh, I got two things for the Attack on Titan. The last part was very sad. Uh, my wife and my sister. And uh, my every time, every time you say my wife, I think it's freaking Borat. I mean, no, 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 like my wife. Yeah, I don't know what you're about. Um, how all of that was was. Aaron thought that he was it was like for a purpose, and at the end, like the credits, it shows like a graveyard and or his tomb, and people still went to war and their civilization, and then they come back up and there's that war part, again. Like that part all of that nice. shit was like. Yeah. For fucking nothing, like he almost wiped off civilization. And no, and well, the still point was so that everybody was on the same playing field going forward. Yeah, but it, the, so the, it, the, the, it, the, the the thought that it was sad that us as humans without Titans were the fucking monsters. Oh like, yeah, we we still fucking find a way to piss somebody off, or they're gonna hold grudges because hey, y'all y'all were the ones that did the rumbling and. Or even something. Though, yeah, something. like, but it's cool because I think they leave it as they could start an, a spinoff. In the future, right? Because that kid yeah. and the dog going yeah. to the tree, where mm-hmm. Aaron's supposed he goes to be inside. buried, yeah. right? And and I think it went back to where the first time, uh, where the founder was, she uh, is yeah. she escaped, right? She goes into a she tree. escaped and she goes into a tree. I right. think it was like it the, was the same tree. Not no, the same no, tree, this, this is the one that Aaron was laying under. Right, this was the one started, on the island. Right, where it started. Yeah, yeah, but I th- I think it leaves it like the founder, like she kind of fell into that that. In the tree, uh, like yeah, the, that like the boy who just went in. That yeah. You could start spot, the whole yeah. thing over again. Ah, you think they'll do something with it, or you think it was just to kind of like give it like a look? I think I think it's it's there for open for just in case they come up with a good storyline. I don't see them reviving it for anything like anytime soon. It's it's it'll be a big mistake. Like you don't want to bring it back when it has a decent ending, because ending shows it's fucking hard. Yeah, mm-hmm. tell that you to know? the people from Game of Thrones. Yeah. Yeah, it had, it had a good ending. I, I, I uh, yeah, I, I sat on it for like a couple of weeks. Like, oh shit! Like, I guess because it, it closed like a a big chapter. Like, I I don't know about y'all, but I had started watching it since maybe 2012, 2013. Like, yeah, it's been out for a while. More than ten years, yeah. or around ten years. Yeah, yeah, but it's just like a lot, a lot of really popular animes that we grew up with are older than that. But you're just. No, 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 but oh, that that it has closed, like that has a closure, like that's like it. The book know? was like, yeah, that's the it. The dust came out, and yeah, done. Yeah, yeah. There's a way, like until the freaking One Piece dudes like finally get oh. their ending. Yeah, that one, that one. I I think uh, Netflix just picked it up, and now Netflix is gonna be releasing episodes every week. 
Yeah, they are, and they're also yeah. they said. But that's with the live action, no? No, 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 no. This is the anime, the like animation. Oh, up to date anime. To too. And oh, I think shit. they said they were gonna reanimate all the old yeah, stuff, from yeah. the old stuff, and they were gonna call it just the smart. One Piece. Mm. So we'll see. It, it's smart because it's smart. some people got mad though because they were like, "Who cares? Oh, Who cares what the they think? Anime. That's stupid." Like literally, like you want these companies to make money so that we get better production, better anime. Because a lot of people, they're like, whenever they go back and start it again, they're like, "Oh, the animation's ass." Yeah. Well, it's like, well, well it, it started age. 20 years ago, yeah. you know? So it, it makes sense. No, 30 why you, years ago. 30 years ago, yeah. Yeah, so it's Damn. just like, yeah, so whenever you, you think about it that way, you're like, it makes sense why they would do it. And, you know, we're, I'm here for it. Well, as long as they don't do a fucking, like, the next chapter and they all turn into babies, like, fucking Dragon Ball Z. Oh, yeah. So That's I saw, I, wait, I saw, I saw a thing. It might connect to the next arc, though. Is and it? They might just be teasing it that way. Because in the manga... I don't know if this is true, but I know in the manga there is an enemy that has like he, look, he looks like a goat. Okay, yeah, and he does magic, and so they're always used to fighting strong people like physical fights. And then this guy comes and fights you with magic. So like, how do you fight someone with magic? You know, when you think about it, like Superman's weakness is magic too, yeah, because like, brute strength can't just. It's like, what do you do? It's like this guy, and I think they mm -hmm. said that this guy seeps uh, seeps the energy out of them, and that mm. something happens so where might. they might be turned into kids. Because of this villain, and it's not just like a side story on the side. It, 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 I mean, I saw a post about it. it could be fake. Mm -hmm. It's just uh, stipulation. But if it is, it's cool. Because because yeah. in the manga, I remember seeing that that villain with the with the horns, and they said that he did magic. The guy's like super fucking strong. Yeah, I don't remember his fucking Mor Moro? Moro? Moro Moro. Yeah, I think Moro is. His name. Pull him up so we can yeah, see. Yeah, him. we can show Moro. I want to see him. That guy. Oh, that dude. This dude. Yeah, I've seen images of him. I've seen yeah. like the other one. Which one? This one? The, the younger looking one? The one on the right hand side? Is that, oh. not, is that not a real thing? I, I don't know. The only one I've seen is like, the one I've seen the most is this one. The old one? This uh, one. So you think people made them look young or you think it's part of like the mangas? Well, th this is this is, looks like a, an animated picture. No, they're, no, they're, but I've, I've seen like more multiple. I've seen that guy before. I don't know how. But <laughs> yeah, I, I saw it in my dreams. No. <laughs> <laughs> that's how the magic yeah, works. Click that good. one with the with the manga panels go up. This one? Yeah, click that one. No, that's definitely made up. Never mind. Well well hopefully it's it, it's you get your, your wish, Danny, and it's just a part of like the story instead of it being a side quest. We'll find out in the next episode of Dragon Ball. <laughs> <sighs> Okay, so yeah, all the amigo, está frío. so so yeah, I want to move on from like nerdy nerdy topics to like like you know. Isn't that what the public is here for? I don't know. I, we might have lost everyone by now. By now. <laughs> if you're still here, you think there's here. chapters in the videos? This yeah, shit. yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, so it is twisty. I I've it been wanting to talk about this for a long time because we're kind of late to this. All right, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of this this disgusting motherfucker named Jeffrey Epstein. Yes. Yeah. So as of late. He's been all over the news, you know, because he had, like, a long list of, like, super powerful friends, you know. He was friends with everybody. Like, everybody who was rich and connected and had power, he wanted to be a part of your life. Okay. Yeah. So, you know, he used to have this island called um, St. Something. I don't remember what it was called. Point being, um, he, he, he came out to be, like, a really big nasty dude. I don't know if we're allowed to say those words, but. They're very top of yeah. So, um, oh, so yeah. Lo and behold, he's a pedophile, and uh, there's a like a lot of names that came up that people weren't surprised because these stories have been out for a long time. Yeah. 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 But the craziest one that we saw was Cat Williams. No, <laughs> no. When he he talked about it. No, the the Will Smith. No. <laughs> no. The craziest one was Stephen Hawking. All right. Stephen Hawking. Oh. Yeah. Really. Yeah. So whenever you open the image. Here is, oh, you know, shit. him on the island. And look, here's the thing, right? If you can't believe that, you know, Stephen Hawking can be a pedophile because of his condition, then you're an ableist, all right? And how dare you, all right? I would never put it past anybody being a creep, right? For the most part, you know, science has already disproved most of his theories. So there's nothing really to hold on to anymore. Like, he was cool for his time. Now we can't defame the dead so we can say whatever the fuck we want. He died? Right. Yeah, he, yeah, he passed dead. away a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. You know that? I don't know. Yeah. Well, point being... Uh, his, last words were, his last words were, there is no God. He died. I thought you were going to make, like, a pedophile joke. 
No, was it? <laughs> was it? I heard. That's what I heard. That that was his last words. But at the end, he started like dipping into religion too, didn't he? Or no? I think he was like big atheist. Oh no. No, but I I, I thought he did kind of. Oh, I don't know. I could be wrong. That's I what know. I heard. I, I could know. Be you wrong. took this 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 me twisting this disgusting thing into a joke to make it sad. <laughs> well, I mean that's we that happened years ago. Okay, so if he was alive today. What would, what he, would he not be that be, not that yeah, he freaking pedophile that's what he would be no uh, he'd be scratching <laughs> he would be scratching the thing like let me out oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> God, he, he got that me that's again. why I said <laughs> hey, that's why I said no he can't <laughs> he got me again I can keep because he, he, he can't move no but he'll be born again so maybe no, no he'd be born no. again he, what, he he didn't die though oh you that's yeah, what you oh you're doing the dragon ball still wishes he's a baby what the fuck so the reason that he's been named in the Jeffrey Epstein files, court files and stuff is because there there was a story about him asking uh, Ghislaine Maxwell mm. to use their money and powers to wipe like this story from like the news. So basically he got intel that the story was going to come out of um, Stephen Hawking that he had been a participated in uh, orgies with minors. Stephen Hawking. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm sorry, but, you know, like, why would anybody need to scrub the internet of shit like that if, it, if it's not true? You know, if it was just fake, who cares? Could have been uh, teaching them uh, different theories. <laughs> How do we know that? So, you don't know that. No, just stop. Just you don't know that. <laughs> no, that, I'm not. Okay, so. <laughs> yeah, 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 maybe he was a professor. Go, he was a professor. Let, let's go sideways. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, so there was two things I've heard. One was the island, and then there was another one, some camp, some plane. That he would throw yeah, parties on the so, plane. Yeah, so so his right? pre, his plane was called on the, the plane. Little, like on the plane. Like he would well, throw parties while they were on flight. No, well, not, like not just well. The the plane took you to the island. Always. Yeah. So I thought there was some. So oh, the plane. The, it was called Little Satan James. That was the island. So it was it was the uh, uh, pre party. They were tailgating yeah, so to <laughs> the island. <laughs> so so it was a pre bachelor party. So the plane thing isn't as <laughs> important as to where it's going. Like the no, flight. I, 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 I had heard like. that that there were some where they didn't go to the island. They just got on the plane and they party. Well, there's, the there's a lot of people who I just say that 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 he was so nice that he would just be like, "Take my jet to wherever you need to go." That's why that's what like all the powerful people are saying, you know. But the the one that's another really big one is the the one of the princes, Prince Charles, I think is the one that people Yeah. Yeah. He's like a known nasty dude. He, like he already had to pay like a big lawsuit because he got accused and his excuse was like you see those pictures couldn't have been me because I'm I can't sweat. So that guy's sweaty. And you know, he lost the case, like he had to pay money. And now he's been named a ton of times by like like Girls who were on the island, okay, you know. So uh, we already know the it's an island full of nasty people, and unfortunately, um, he was a big, powerful dude, and he had a lot of influences. He was rich; everybody wanted to be around him. So, like, even even like, let's just assume like you were just happened to be in the same room as him. Like DiCaprio got named in it, but it was just because he was on the phone and he mentioned DiCaprio in it, and so on the thing like the list that they gave you. Was literally uh, the list of just people who were named in the stories, and like some girls who are minor, so they excluded their names from the list, which were, I think were like three, okay. and they're the ones accusing everybody. Yeah, but you know it, it's crazy. But the, the news and like social media, have they been talking about Leo being on his? No, on no, the no. Well, it's because it, this story has been out for like mm -hmm. years now, mm -hmm. and it all because the guy and the guy ended up. You know, he hanged himself, but then everybody was like, "Well, how did he do that?" This was like top security, yeah, and jail, the, and and, there and the guard happened. The, yeah. the watch happened to like walk away to do something, and then they come back, and he was he he hanged himself. So they were saying that it's too coincidental. Obviously, just yeah, so conspiracy. Yeah, I don't, I don't I I personally hate a lot of conspiracies because they literally like sometimes hurt people, but this is the only one I'm willing to to. To believe a little. Well, what about it is a conspiracy? I mean, right now... The I conspiracy mean, is that they're saying that he hung himself and not that he was murdered. I'm sorry, but if you are... If you're or backwards, right? The conspiracy is that that someone killed well, him. Well, what is a conspiracy, right? Well, a conspiracy is like... Uh, conspiracy. An, an idea is like said to deceive people. I think I think well, everybody that, wants the, to be believe that it was a suicide. Right, but that's but what I'm we, saying. We all think that he was murdered. Right, but I think the conspiracy is always what goes against... What the official truth supposed to be? So the official truth, the is official that truth, he, is hung he, hung, he hung himself. So the conspiracy, nobody is believes that. that. Yeah. yeah. So that's the conspiracy. Mm -hmm. But 
I mean, yeah. I, it, I mean, when I think of a conspiracy, I think of like something crazy. I don't know. About. I mean, no, th- it's, it's, this, this, like, yeah. this is a really big one. It's like this well, guy. I mean, cra- by crazy, I mean guy like who have presidents. By on crazy, his I mean jet. Like, by crazy, I mean like the aliens came and killed them because they were on the list too. Oh, that's what I mean oh, by conspiracy. Shit. Dude, we didn't look for gray men on the freaking <laughs> no, but list. That's what I mean by conspiracy. It's just like, like yeah. You know. I, I, I conspiracy just could be something like the, the 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 flag was waving when we went to the moon. Yeah, no, it could be. I'm no, just no, 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 no. The conspiracy there is that we faked the moon landing. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so, so, I mean, that doesn't have to do with like aliens or stuff. Like, How do you know? <laughs> that's literally in space. That's the terrible nah, analogy. No, <laughs> like, I, I know what no, you're saying. But I'm saying like the thought, like Danny's saying, like no, it has no, to be no, like I, extreme I, for it to be. Yeah. No, I'm saying that that's how I. Like, I just think it, it, it just didn't it. reach like the the height that you. The, that and you, especially because most people, like, I don't think there is a lot of people that would say, "No, nah, I really think he hung himself." I think it's just that's what the official truth is, and then nobody believes it. So then it's like conspiracy i'm like yeah at least you have some well you know like you know we, we obviously have, we, that's we, just being technical we have like stories really like matter. you know like the fbi like had nothing to do or the cia had nothing to do with the killing of mlk and you know and like later down the line you're like yeah we were investigating and we were keeping track and blah blah right you know so it's just like like right. it's it's do we we think that they might want to protect powerful people and like i'm telling you he had presidents on his plane presidents on his islands Trump literally was all like, "Yeah, Epstein like women, like girls a lot younger," you know. So it's just like, like whenever like everybody knows he's a pedophile and everybody still decides to hang out with him, like he's gonna have dirt on you because if not, like, right. it just it just it just seems too far fetched to believe that you know, oh the guard happened to be away or asleep or whatever, and when you're on like suicide watch, you know, like oh sorry we 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 turned off the screen because the football game was on or something. And then the guy's dead. Well, I, I, I would, uh, I don't know if, I, you know that, but I don't know if Danny knew. I, I, I used to work at the jail in downtown as a corrections officer. And yeah, that suicide watch, like if you had any tips or whatever, that the guy was suicidal, you, you keep a very, yeah. very cle- uh, close eye to him because. Especially someone that everybody in the country mm-hmm. is talking about for something, mm-hmm. s- such big allegations. Yeah. You, like that it's, guy, you no, gotta and, go, and, and, and you're you're supposed to protect them. Like, right? They they, they do different things that uh, there's different protocols that need to be met. Um, like at at the jail, if it was a, uh, like, you know how sometimes there's like shootout with police officers, and sometimes they kill like three or four people or whatever. Um, when when those guys were getting moved through cells or whatever, they closed down the whole building. Mm. Because they don't want like other correction officers. Like if you knew the officer that got shot, or, or they don't want like uh, them to get like fucking jumped. So they everybody gets put on 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 like uh, there's different protocols that are being met. Before. So so with him, if he's already on on like suicide watch, like yeah, there should have been somebody no complaining no, yeah, they, on him. They do it. They do it in shifts too. Because I know it and here in GP, like somebody happened to act like like they were all like I think. Uh, the girl went on lunch and something, and the dude ended up like you know committing suicide while being on suicide watch. Then the whole thing gets they get sued because you were on watch. Where the fuck were y'all at, right? So the thing with like he said, with it being so high profile, it just doesn't make any sense. We that's why it's a conspiracy because it's so far fetched, you know. But that's not why we're here. We're here to goof and gaff goof and on gaff. freaking um, Stephen Hawking. Let's see, I forget what the hell was on here. I don't know. It's been a while. This has been on the dock for a while. Yeah, so here it goes. It's just um, basically this is um, the accusation where you can find the 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 mention. Yeah. He's mentioned twice, saying for allegedly participating in an underage orgy on um, Little Saint James Island. Yeah, and is it that? called Little yes. Little Saint James Island? Yeah, yeah. Oh, and and for those of you who might not believe that he, he Stephen Hawking was a piece of shit, I heard the story that he actually cheated on his wife with like a uh, a a uh, he couldn't move. <laughs> uh, who the fuck did he cheat on? It was like the the nurse, ah, the nurse. And it, it, the, I think that one came out on the. Did it come out in the movie? Because they they made a movie about him. I didn't watch it, but but point it was, it was good. I well, watched it. Point being is just like <laughs> Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Dude, literally he was a fucking piece of shit because like oh somebody who stays with him through his 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 disease and shit. And then she cheats on him and he leaves her. 
And then <laughs> the comment was all like, bro couldn't do anything and still cheated. Yeah, for that, I'm like, yeah, man, they're fucking dogs. You know, get that ass. <laughs> so, so point being, because I, I always think like whenever people are get older, they get infantilized. Like, people look at, like, like old white men, like, oh, he's like Santa Claus and shit. I'm like, no, there's a lot of old sickos that look just like Santa Claus, right? Just because, you know, somebody is sick, decrepit, and, you know, like, dying, doesn't mean they can't be disgusting motherfuckers, you know? So, fear every old man, you know? Men will cheat even if they can't move. And, yeah, fuck Jeffrey Epstein. Damn, it's crazy that he was on the list. I, I didn't really like follow him or anything. Yeah. Uh, I just know he was a big name in the in the science community. I think it was just mostly because of his condition and they're like, oh look, he's he's smart. Oh, he was smart though. Yeah, like, no, he, I'm he not had, I'm not saying, oh, but I'm saying yeah. the reason that he got as big as he did, because there's a lot of smart people out there. But do all of them suffer from that? No, but I, I do think some of his theories. His theories I mean, have all been like disproven by now. Well, I mean, but, but that's kind of that's kind like, that's kind of the norm in There's also though. theories that fucking uh, the the Earth wasn't flat, and somebody said, oh, "Okay, or gravity, or no, like, I, I, like you, you well, eventually my, at the knowledge that you have at that point, it's the only thing yeah." But what are, are we supposed to still be all like, "Oh yeah, he was incredible for 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 what?" Well, it's because the thing, uh, the thing when it, it comes evolves, to, shit evolves, right? Well, the thing with science is like, if if you look at the history, it's like ninety nine percent of the theories have been disproven or yeah, yeah. have come out to be false. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And that's so, because there is only one correct way. And so someone's going to be like, what if it's this one? What if it's this one? What if it? And so then you can f- prove a bunch of things or try to prove a bunch of things and find out that they're not real. But you can use some of them. Yeah, because you the don't repeat them. initial ones. No, because you don't repeat yeah, them either. And you might tweak it a little bit. Yeah, you well, might tweak the, it just a little bit more. Or another one or is. Or use it as a base yeah. to come up with your own. So, I mean. Or you can also, like, the other one is. Or you can be completely off and someone else just proves it some other way yeah you you yeah, could you're right you're you right. could but also like at the same time some some theories are like oh shit that 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 could be it everybody like yeah and agrees. it makes sense but then it, it's not true and then someone else says oh i have a theory and then someone says yeah no that's been disproven don't even go there and i felt like that happened to me once but that's another story but uh <laughs> was it the one about the moon no the moon something about some explosions Oh no no! That was just something I saw on the news, and we couldn't <laughs> find the footage anymore. No, when I when I when I was in 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 school, yeah, um, I was trying to do a project with a professor when I first like met him, and I I I thought I had found a way to solve the problem. So I go and I meet him, and I and I'm trying to explain to him like I think we might be able to do this, this and that. And I'm not even halfway through it. He just stops me. He goes, "No, nah, that's not gonna work." And I'm like. Okay, can you at least hear me? Like you don't even know where I'm going. Mm. But the, and then later on, like four weeks later, I have another idea. So I go to him and I go, "Okay, I have an idea. This I'm not even halfway done." He's like, "Okay, that one should work. Uh, go ahead and start doing this and that." And I was like, "I'm not even done." So part of me thinks he already knew the answer. Yeah, he was just seeing if a student could also come across the same answer. So every time I came with a wrong answer, <laughs> he was already like, "I know where you're going. Stop. Yeah. No." Like yeah. Well, my po- my point Sorry. is is Sorry for hijacking is, the Ipes team. No, I I just like the 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 fact that it's all like he was popular because he was suffering through that and appeared to have good ideas, right? So now his his legacy is erased because he was wrong, and he's gonna be known as a pedophile. You know, if this is wrong, sorry, bro. I don't but think you he's should. gonna get known as a pedophile. Like that's. I'm sorry, what but like if, if, if you go if you Google him now, mm-hmm. that's all that comes up. And with him being wrong, no one's gonna source him, no one's gonna cite him. It, it's over. Well, if I watch the movie, like there's a lot of documentaries that you'll I, never I know, watch. I, I know, but if, let's say I I stumble across his movie. I don't know that that movie is is about him because I, I didn't I didn't know the movie was about well, him. You're when watching, I was watching the it, when big, I was watching Big Bang Theory. Him. Yeah, you see him. There. You're not gonna think like, oh, that that guy. Like no, I mean he still left a legacy, even though we we know like the no. I, I don't know. I think it's hard to just say this is this is the only thing he's gonna be known for. No, I I think it's just like R. Kelly, how he put on the amazing music, and now all he's known for peeing on girls and going to jail. It's just 
The next generations who saw this on TV, don't forget because it was fresh in their minds. Who's going to remember them? Where's the next legacy going? What about like in the like in the long, long, long? So you think run? they didn't talk about him like in, in schools or university? No, no, you no, you, 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 no, you, you're gonna stop talking about him. No, first of all, like the for optics speaking, like the mm-hmm. moment you look like bad, like, like the the lady who was just ostracized from Harvard. Okay, there was people protesting what's going on in Palestine. She didn't want to go hard against the students protesting because it's their First Amendment right to do, and that's the correct choice. All right. All the donors were like, oh, wow, you're a freaking anti-Semitic. All they care about is optics. All they care about is how they look. So they, they fired their ass. They, they found like a bunch of shit that, that uh, wouldn't necessarily push anybody over the top to being fired. But they kept harassing her that she eventually resigned. Right? All they care about is how they look. What, what I was so who, who other people were, were on the list? Well, we know that Bill Clinton was on there. So is Bill Clinton? Bill Clinton. Like, Bill Clinton gonna, was the president. Right, but we're not going to talk to him. We're not going to talk about him. Like, when we talk about him as a president, now we say, but he was a part of the Epstein report. No, like, no, no, I, no, I feel no. like it's the same thing with this guy. Like, yes, we, we know his name on the list. We know he did, like, dumb shit, but that's completely been, not they, the whole... They've been talking, they've been talking, about, it, they've been talking about Bill Clinton on the list for, like, the past five, yeah. six years. Yeah. That's all... They, look, I, I, don't, I don't know where, like, because, you know, whenever you divide it into left and right, mm-hmm. right? The left is like, if he did that shit, throw him under the jail. Mm-hmm. The right is like, oh, your guy's a pedophile. And on the left, they're like, he's not our guy. Because after the doc that came out of the way everybody treated Monica Lewinsky, who was a like a 19-year-old girl mm-hmm. that the president took advantage of, all right? In the in, whenever it happened, everyone was like, Monica Lewinsky's a whore. She's a freaking uh like a uh, home record. And like literally the next generation who's looked back at it, just like the way we look back at Britney, is like, no, Bill Clinton was the fucking power and he took advantage of it. Nobody likes Bill Clinton. No one's ever going to defend Bill Clinton. But the thing does not change that he's only going to be known for being a disgusting motherfucker. And yes, cool. Bill Clinton, Bill Clinton, Bill Clinton, Bill Clinton, his legacy is also destroyed. But it not just on, on, on the Epstein. You just said the Monica Lewinsky. What, what I'm getting, I'm not, I'm not disagreeing with you. I'm not saying no, that, I, that Stephen Hawking is not going to be known for being on that list or, or for doing pedophile shit. What I'm saying is. That's not the only thing he's going to be known for. If your work is discredited, the only thing left is that you're a fucking pedophile. There's nothing else that's going to come up because no one's ever going to source you. The last thing that people are going to remember you by is you being on that list because that's the last thing that came out well, like about Bill, you. Bill Clinton, he, he was a president. He did the Monica Lewinsky. And now if somebody says Bill Clinton, do you automatically think that or do you think... Uh, uh, right you, now, yes. You, you think, no, no, no. Right now, yes. You could, but you can think of, uh, of a whole bunch he, of things. So, and what I'm getting at is that's not the only thing. Like, there's other things that they're known for. And I'm not saying that it's right or wrong. And I'm not saying that that I, like Stephen Hawking's. I'm not going to say that's that's the only thing like, that comes to mind when they, I think they, about you, it. What you, do you, you, what can, do you, think, you can literally look up how many times people say someone's name online. And because I'm pretty it's fresh. Sh- no, no, no. It's, no, 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 it, it's over. Does Google exist in? Mm-hmm. You won't see that there's every time there's a story about freaking Epstein, it's the highest it's been since he's been fucking president. I'm sorry, it's over for Bill Clinton too. Well, I mean, I think I think it, it. Yeah, I mean, I think right now, you know, there is like how we view it, like ours. It's fresh, this, yeah. Well, this generation mm-hmm. and the next, and maybe the next a hundred years. But then I think of like like Genghis Khan, right? Guy was around like centuries ago yeah and the thing that people most remember about him is well he conquered most of asia and he's father of like yeah eight percent of the most in the of, world <laughs> most of the, peop- of the people in the world right yeah there's a lot of details that involve that he was he was he conquered it means he killed a lot of people and he was the father of eight percent of the people he of the world raped well he raped a lot of women but the point is that that uh that's the two things that they're, they're that he's known for Two things. Those two things. Right, two, saying, two things. Right. right those yeah. two things. Raping and pillaging. No, raping <laughs> and pillaging. And, and the fucking conquering, right? Yeah, well, some some like some like people, like, we're far removed from that. Mm-hmm. We're like, I don't know, when was he? Like, 800 years ago? I, I don't no know. Clue. But what I'm getting at is it's two different things. But then, I mean, Even I'm saying, though he did one that's really bad, right. he's not just known for that. He's known for two things. What else do you know him for? 
He just no, said no, two wait, things, no, right? No, he no, said no, Congress and then you, the What else do you know Bill Clinton for? Huh? What else do you know him for? He's the president, the Monica Lewinsky, and then this. So two sex scandals and what did he do during his presidency? I don't know. He passed the bill. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you. Like, 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 literally. You're like, supposed to give him the. He said he passed the bill. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, <laughs> when that, they went over his head, he's. No, I heard it. I was <laughs> waiting for him. I, I'm, I'm, I'm arguing. Él está you know, apasionado. Yeah. Con yeah? Yeah. No, but what I'm gonna say is like, as far as like the scientific side of him, I, I think there's a part that we don't know how it's gonna age. Like as far as like his contribution in the scientific world, I'm sure he published a bunch of papers and. Who knows how people will react to it? Mm -hmm. Obviously, Genghis Khan happened 800 years ago. There was no internet. There was no newspapers. There was no text messages. There was no like, did you see what Genghis Khan just did? Yeah. Right? <laughs> there was none of that. So how it ages, it, it might be different than how Genghis Khan aged and other big people that did a bunch of messed up stuff. Yeah. How he ages, as far as like how people will view him in 200 years, is it, I don't know, we, we probably cannot even imagine that. Mm -hmm. How we're going to view it, I'm sure there's a lot of people that might want to avoid citing him for the next couple of years. I, I, and if it's, like, proven, like, if, if a video leaks like, or something that's, like, look, like, 100% evidence, there is no doubt, there's nothing to question. For sure he did that. I'm sure there's going to be a lot of people that might not want to cite his work and might not want to be affiliated with his work. And... uh it also will depend, I guess, also on how how many other people are willing to speak out in his defense and say, well, you know, like, he was a great professor or, or whatever. Like, depending on how that plays out, like, if this is the last story we hear about this, nothing else comes out because there is, other than the first picture that we showed, other than that, there's no pictures, there's nothing. People might not really um, keep it. But if there is more, then... It might it might so take pr uh, um, um, let, let, priority. Let's, let's, priority let's, yeah. Let's say that his movie. Residence, but let's say his movie. His movie dropped a couple of years ago, right? Let's say his movie's on HBO Max. Let's say, or let's say Warner Brothers was the one that picked it up. Do you think he gets dropped because of this list? Probably not. So that that's probably what I'm not saying. HBO. Yeah, HBO that's what, that's what I'm saying. Like. It isn't like we're just canceling him and he's getting erased and this is the only thing well, he's going to known the for. The thing is know? he's dead. There's nothing to cancel because he's dead. Like, yeah. like, why are you going to punish him? And that's him? why we can There's say whatever the hell we want about him because no, we no, can't no, you're right. Yeah, you're now, right. Now, so as far as canceling goes, like, there's nothing to do. Now, obviously, you, you could... It you tarnishes could, his image. Well, I mean, well, sure, but obviously, like, there is something admirable about his life because... He got really sick on his when he, he got was, two girls, man. Like one, whenever he, I'm saying well, that it was admirable. <laughs> well, it's admirable that 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 he, he was, was fighting through all that was, instead no, of just he fucking was, saying like well, I'm not gonna keep studying or go on well, with the world. Yeah, I'm he gonna was fucking fine. keep going. Yeah. Right, he was fine until he when was he like 22, yeah, yeah. and then he got this like very rare nasty disease. Was it Luke Garrix that he has? Was it ALS or something? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know what it's called. I just Google it. Yeah, so but my, my, what I was trying to say is like there's something admirable about just him saying, you know, I'm going to persevere despite this disease. But um, sorry, I'm trying to think how to type. <laughs> <laughs> and, and so that you can admire that ALS. ALS, yeah. But at the same time, you can say, you know what? He's not a saint. So I cannot... Say everything he did in his life was right, but there's something that he did right, and that is persevere, even though he got a really messed up disease. So that that's what I'm saying. Like, well, that that helps on what I'm telling you. Like, he doesn't just get lost because of that. Like, that's not no, gonna no. be the only, Sorry, only, only thing over, you know about him, man. It's over. If, if what he just said it, at the end of the day, what he did was still motivational. Of there's millions of motivational stories. I'm sorry. There's older people who have survived with ALS. He wasn't mm -hmm. the oldest living ALS survivor. No, he right? wasn't. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, look, he's only known for his contributions into the science world. All right. And now the pedophile island. All mm -hmm. right. So if you get discredited in one of them, I'm sorry. You're only known for the pedophile island. But do, does, it, does everybody know that he... he all, all the all the theories that he thought about have have been debunked. Did you know that? No, I mean I don't. You, follow you see physics, what I'm saying? Really, so it's so it's I not. Really no, but I mean, yeah. But how often do you talk about them? How, how often do you talk about them? You don't. But you know exactly. He's that's what I'm telling you. Though, the, the, in the wheelchair. The, the, well, he is, up he, the, he is the, out. Of, the, he is look, not look, in the, our the further, world. The further we go out, as far as the less and less he's going to be relevant. 
Well, he was actually like he's big in in his country, right? Because like, yeah, well, in the well, university well, he, and he, shit he, and everything, like, he I, went I, over there to like yeah. uh, uh, what is it over there in Great Britain, like like well, good we, schools, right? To be honest, I don't know. Like we they, okay, so I view it from two angles. One is you can view this person as a historical figure, right? Like oh, Stephen Hawking, scientist. That we have the internet. We literally now have ChatGPT who remembers everything. So if you were to be curious about who's fuck was Stephen Hawking you just Stephen Hawking when Chad GPT oh scientist is this later on got caught doing this <laughs> after his death mm-hmm. whatever and 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 that's you fine. might you might say oh well, that's still someone that existed right so that that's one one layer how you how he, he will be remembered as some historical figure as any other name that's on the internet nowadays like the Unquad Vogler's podcast right but then there's the other layer which comes uh, 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 like appreciative like how much do you appreciate a person? Yeah. Like, like a, as far as a, you look back in time and you look at a, like Genghis Khan, like how many people will look back at it? I keep, I, I, I keep naming him because he's so far back removed. Yeah. That no, like if I said, I'm not going to say it. If I said another name more recent, then it's like, the fuck, bro, don't say that. But he's so far removed that I don't think we have any attachment, like emotional attachment to the well, story. Just, just, just th- bring up like Bob Ross or who's the guy from the neighborhood that everybody loves fondly. They look back at him. They share memes. They still share videos of him. Right. 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 That's Mr. Rogers. Ro- Mr. Rogers. I'm sorry. He has documentaries. His story is ne- not, never going to be let go because people love them. What about the other like, guy? The like, guy that like, like, like people of our generation are showing their kids Mr. Rogers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's how a legacy is created. Right. So so at that yeah. level of appreciation, unfortunately, he, he does lose it because now it's like, well, if he was doing that kind of stuff, it just kind of like, like it gives you a distaste for his story. Mm-hmm. Right, because it's like okay, well, he did something great, which was, despite his disease, he persevered and he did good, like as far as his scientific work was. But then after that, he did other stuff that were very terrible. Mm-hmm. I, again, I, assuming I, that I, it is I, all true, I, I just like that the cheater story is confirmed because it proves that he could still be a fucking dog. Yes. Yeah, you, you, you sure know. that that's, and, and that's like for I sure. Said, but the the part that I don't disagree with you, like he could have done it, he could have not. Like I, I'm not saying that. He didn't. What what I'm trying to argue is that he's not only going to be known for that. Not only, only, it's only good. all. Cap, I, I, I would like to. I would like to define something. I, it's. I think it's a matter of definition. What do you guys mean by known? Look, right now, social media like you, has you the biggest life you, you, span. You think, you think of. You think of uh, what's his name? Uh, Genghis Stephen Hawking. You, 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 think <laughs> of, you think of Stephen Hawking, and right away you say. The first thing that pops in your mind, and the only the word only, I'm pretty sure the, the only, only thing, you thing could, that pops you, you in your mind is was a he was, he was on the guy. He, he was on the island. Okay, it's, yeah. So you oh, see what I'm saying? Like uh, uh, only is where. Right. So so there is known as far as just memory. Like oh, I remember Stephen Hawking. I remember these things about him. Like there's that, and then there is like like legacy. Like as far as value, you mm-hmm. know. Like is he going to be remembered? Mm-hmm. As far as. There are some people that are their names are so famous that they keep getting thrown out, right? Like Genghis Khan <laughs> and uh, Laverick. Ra- Ra- just a Robin Williams. <laughs> yeah. well, I'm trying to go. Mr. No, I'm trying to go. Barbara. Really, I'm trying to go really back in time. You know, like like as far as I can go, and this just that's, like, that's the one you can remember <laughs> right now because it became a joke. So I'm trying to just go back really, really and back Julius in time. Caesar. Yeah, like I'm trying. Yeah. Uh, sure. Pontius Pilate. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Pontius Pilate. Jesus. Jesus. Uh, but I'm trying to just go back in time, like no, like old names. I'm just saying, like they, they will, they remember by something very specific. I don't think he will be remembered by either of the two. I don't think like in 500 years from now, it's like oh, like Stephen Hawking, oh that pedophile, or oh the scientist, he might not be remembered by either. But I'm sure he's gonna be in a book somewhere where they talk, like kind of like even the Bill Clinton. There's gonna be a book that has precedence. Bill Clinton. He did this, this, and this. And then those who want to be fair will say he did this, this, and this while he was president. Later on in life, got caught doing these things. And that, that, that's where my argument is only like, yeah, he is going to be known for that. I'm not saying that he's not going to be known for that and th- maybe the next generation. But like he said, there's something written. You can ask Chad GPT and he's yeah, going to say but I other can, things. I can write and a book that. and be all like, yo, plants are and grass is green because they eat green crayons. It doesn't fucking matter. That's what I'm trying to say. Who cares if it's been written? The problem is, it's not gonna. You're not gonna teach your children about him See, it's because the minute they look yeah. him up, he, he's. He, I think Oscars is more ground to like what's like right now, mm-hmm. and I think you're being more technical as far as like 
history book. Like somebody opens a book and goes. Yeah. Not, not only that, not only that. I'm like, because right now, like the internet has more reach than anything ever. All right, this is a, a story. Like yo, we still know. We still pay attention what to about true Neverland? crime. Wait, what wait, about wait, 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 No, don't touch it. Change it. Right now, true crime is the biggest in the world. I'm sorry, podcast. True crime dominates. All right, yeah. this is a big case. Every single podcast talked about the Epstein files. All right, not only that, this is gonna come out in future docs. Mm -hmm. Everything online is gonna surpass. Any freaking written literature. I'm sorry. The, the only right, okay. Right. I agree with you. There's only one thing that that I would say that kind of goes against what you just said, and that is there's so much shit going on online that in a month from now something new happened and people are talking about that, and then people forget about this. Like like I, Epstein, it wasn't forgotten, but for a while, like nobody talked hold. about it anymore. Cause there's a bunch of other shit going on. No, no, that, that's, not that's not why. That's not why. That was not, because everybody was waiting. For, that's what everybody. No, everybody was waiting for the case. No, I, to I, I agree. Progress. But, but I, I'm, what I'm saying is, it, it wasn't continuously being talked about, right? It's like, okay, well, there's nothing to talk about anymore. Next story, something happened. COVID happened. Next story, Israel happened. Ukraine, Russia happened. Yeah, he's right. And, and so then, like, I, I, I you can I, always bring it up, you, you, and you're you like, have, fuck, you remember? To, to your side, I, I would say you have now the internet. Which yeah. will save everything now. ChatGPT remembers everything past a certain date, uh, as far as we can evaluate. PC, yeah. But uh, but but then also at the same time, as far as what's fresh in people's minds, people forget. And and it's not that that Stephen Hawking who. It's just like you just don't even think about it. Like you know, and then five months from now, you're like, oh shit, I forgot that yeah. happened. Look, we, we we've given this way too much time. I have a real guru pit I want to get oh, into. Oh my goodness! So, Wait, this was in a group. This was not even the guru pit. We haven't even touched anything in the folders, man. I have real topics. All right. Hey, Rick, read this for us. Many agree that centerpieces are meant to be taken home, while others claim that they should be definitely be left on the table. I think this this is a good argument I have because I remember freaking going to family junctions and stuff and all the, the moms sending their kids to go steal other table centerpieces. Yeah. So you're about to have a wedding. Are your are you? Yeah. <laughs> that was my question. Are your centerpieces for 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 grabs? Well, it's because the the venue that we got already includes some. Yeah, and they be they're they 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 belong to the venue. Ooh. But but my thing is like even I think with I didn't you, get mine stolen, but we told them that the flowers were yeah because uh, we took the flowers. <laughs> the, 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 the flowers were up uh, up for grabs, but not the centerpieces. Yeah, but the flowers were. I mean, it was a, a pretty big. Uh, the stands okay. were the stands. We had to rent them. Yeah, and uh, we had to count them and, and give them the give them back. Yeah. I think I remember putting them away. And, and, and I think a lot of people thought that they were so beautiful that that the flowers and everything were like supposed to stay there, so they didn't so take a it. A lot of people left them. I remember so I was saying, "Take them, take grab those." There's <laughs> another one over there. Yeah, so they didn't take it. And yeah. uh, the next day for the recalentado. Um, we had centerpieces for the tables for the next day for the, not the recalentado, well, the recalentado, but the after party or the day after we, as Hispanics. You dropped the whole handle of crown that day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was insane. The, uh, oh, and shout out to my sister. I, I didn't tell you about it. So uh, for the Reyes Magos for Christmas, or we, we call it Christmas part two. Yeah. Um, my sister gave me and my wife a rosary. And the rosary had uh, the flowers from 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 our wedding. Oh shit! So yeah, she she like turned it into the little beads or whatever, and she gave us that for like epoxy. Did I don't know the process of how she did it, but it was it was really nice. That's awesome. Um, so we had a Christmas party uh for for in, in last month, and the centerpieces were were really nice, and we told uh we told the people like, hey, y'all can. Y'all can take the centerpieces. I, I think that should be the rule. Like if, but, if they say you can take them, but the way the way they presented it, because the 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 centerpieces that we had, uh, it wasn't. I'm sorry, it wasn't a, a Christmas party. It was a uh, we did a construction conference, so we invited a whole bunch of people, and there was there was classes, there were lectures, there were sponsors, 
and there was a contractor that used to give um, for Christmas. They used to do like dump trucks or or uh, forklifts, but it was like wooden, so it was really nice. Like, and they would give them out, and we had uh, I don't know like twenty of them. So we had one on every table, and they were really nice because they were big. At the end, uh, at the end of lunch, the uh, the director was like, "Hey, uh, talk to your table and whoever's birthday amongst yourselves. Find out whose birthday is, is the closest." And then she left it like that, like y'all just. And then the she service. gave her like five minutes, and then she was like, "Okay, whoever's birthday is the closest, um, y'all get the centerpiece, and y'all get to take it home or whatever." Mm. But it was funny because when we were sending it up, uh, somebody told me that the way their custom is the first person to leave takes the centerpiece. For us, I've, I was like, "Well, fuck!" I was last. Yeah, man. I was always in the impression like. Whoever is last, you yeah. you take it. Yeah, that like, makes no, no sense. Why yeah, the, the first person? Because the, then you leave like the whole uh, yeah, yeah, e- that, evening yeah. without that one having the other piece. Yeah. The person was like, no, 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 it's the first person. I was like, Man, I've no. never seen that. And she's like, the at all the parties, well, they they weren't gonna take the centerpiece, but it was somebody that was helping out. Mm-hmm. They were like, no, I, from what I understand, it's always the first. I was like, not me. That makes no sense. I mean, I guess if you're the first one, you can claim it, but you got to stay. No, no, no. Like, they said the first one, the first person to leave. Like, like well, shit. Then you eat lunch, you finish eating. Like, all right, I'm yeah. out. It's I'm like out. an incentive to get out. Yeah, I'm <laughs> out. I'm out. <laughs> yeah, that, that makes absolutely no sense. You leave the table without a centerpiece for the rest of the evening. That's just dumb. Yeah. So I, 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 I'm, I'm glad you you disagreed with them because you were right. But yeah, but look at this centerpiece that this dude's holding. Hell no. No way in hell can you take that home. I don't know. I mean, I, I guess if the people making the party bought them and they're willing to give yeah. them away, so so. But at that one, I would ask. I would be like, so that's that's the for question. you. That's for the question you ask. You ask like, if it's a quinceanera, no one's you ever you, ask. They just you, fucking you, take it. No, but I mean, some of them like it's you know that it's, it's like not at his at his when we saw the centerpieces, I was like. Ah, this cannot be taken. They're like too fancy. And then the flowers, I'm like, I'm pretty sure those could be taken. But you know, let's just actually at that point, I like, like that. Danny was in that mentality. At, of, oh, what am I gonna steal? At, at that point, at that point, we're like, let's just wait and see if five people or more take flowers. Then it's okay for us to steal them too. <laughs> and people, people usually yeah. know because they know like the family that's right. closest to the party. That's There's usually one. a comment like, "Yeah, take the centerpiece or take the." You can tell yeah. what's custom and what stays. And I think that's another one like. If, if I, like, me going to Rick's wedding, like, I know Rick, but I don't know, like, any of his family, like, not much. I knew his dad. If you would have asked Oscar, so, Oscar probably would have known. Right. Because we would have right. talked about so, it. But for me, like, if, if like, also when Joel got married, like, I'm like, well, he invited his family and everything. We're like, we're just, we're friends. But, you know, I, I, I don't want to be the one that takes a centerpiece. I'm sure a family member would appreciate more taking a centerpiece. Yeah. So to me, I'm like, okay, well, let's just look. If, the, if there are leftovers. Which is Joel? Joel was the photography guru ah, that came here that brought the yes. old. I was thing. like, I know that name. The old right? typewriter, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. He, oh, I think he's probably a dad right now, like oh, a new, like a brand new oh, dad, like congrats, from last congrats. week or something. Because he told me like three weeks ago, he's like, "Oh, my wife's about to give birth, so congrats." But I was gonna say, uh, I think that also matters. Like, if if you're a, if you're not close to the family, like super close, like you know, there's a bunch of cousins and aunts, and you're like, you're 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 honored to be invited as a friend, but that's it. You're like, well, you look around, right? And you're like, okay, well, I think they have more of a right to the centerpiece than I do. Oh, you think that there's like a uh, seniority so, yeah, claim? I think so. Yeah. Okay. I think so. so, 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 <laughs> and, I, and then at that point, if they don't take it and it's fair well, it's to grab, daddy. he's then the I'll generous guru. Yeah. Well, you know, then I'll take it. Yeah. Well, that's, at that that's point, nice. that's nice that you you were so considering. I took all thirty centerpieces. No <laughs> <I took them. laughs> <laughs> you're actually using them in your way. Yeah. It's kind of coincidental. So, so for yours, you have to return them. We we haven't gotten that far because uh, we do we are thinking of giving something out like as far as like little gifts and stuff. But uh, doesn't the venue? So the centerpieces we didn't get it from the venue. Okay, this one includes centerpieces. So we I think depends. we had it, but we we ended up getting it from the flower guy. The flower mm-hmm. guy was the one that got it, and the flower guy. I want to say the venue does have a flower guy, but we went on our own. Mm, like, okay. Yeah. Well, we haven't met with the venue for for that stuff yet, so I guess once we get there, we'll know. We'll get more clear on what they have. We all plan on getting a. Well, I guess we can talk about it later. But we all plan on getting a flower guy, like a separate. 
Does or you have to go to the salon. Or a flower. Wow, girl. that's so sexist of you. Well, it's because the guy that I contracted was a, was a guy. <laughs> no, I know. No, we, they, we, they know more about flowers. They, they actually give flowers for a living. Ooh. The girls receive flowers. Whoa. So, yeah, you're, you're absolutely right about that. Well, no, we, I we trust the guy. I don't flowers. know because guys are the ones buying the flowers. I That's buy all the flowers I give my girlfriend. That's what I'm saying. So why would I go to a girl that receives them? But don't you get a cue from your girlfriend whether she liked them or not? And then you go, ooh. Didn't really like these. And now I don't really ask for permission. They 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 they, they, they fake they, it. They, they like oh they my like God, they like gifts. I love this one. Look look, she told me once what her favorite flowers were. If they don't got them, I gotta make something up. That's true. Yeah. Good point. Did, mm-hmm. Well, we did get someone already for the flowers for the church and for like the bouquets and stuff. Mm. Bouquets. <laughs> but we, we but uh, I we don't know if we're gonna go with like fake flowers maybe for the venue. We don't know yet. That's mm. that part. We're still in a little bit in limbo. <laughs> It's, it's expensive, bro. <laughs> Flowers are fucking expensive. Yeah, I do. That. I, I, I just, uh, well, it doesn't matter. Like, let us move forward. But if y'all have a garden, you want to donate some flowers? <laughs> Not right now because it's winter. I'm about to, well, the rosas, they are alive. My mom has some rosas. They, 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 they can withhold the winter. I'm gonna start yeah, clipping them. Did so you, did you bring the, the ducks inside? I did not. I think ducks ducks are very uh, yeah, durable with against are. the weather. So I just put them in their pen as I normally do, it, and I put an extra blanket so mm-hmm. the wind wouldn't go through to them. And uh, Yo, in the morning, they're fine. We didn't even talk about it. We're here. Oh, We're well, podcasting. Like, like three hours ago, one of the ducks was just floating in the little the water. in the water. Like he's just yeah. laying in there. And I'm like, dude, that, that thing had a it had a <laughs> layer of ice it. like this. He, he this was ice skating instead of floating <laughs> on the water. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, I had to like hit it with a stick to break it and remove it. Oh, he was just laying in there like it's like it's Christmas. I mean, like it's summer. So they, they don't really care. Yeah, no, it's, uh, their feathers are dope. Yeah, yeah, but you, you were want saying? to talk about the winter? Yeah, well, I, what I are the well? We have to finish this. What's pit. the veridic of this guru pit? I think. I mean, <sighs> I think there was literally like three answers. <laughs> I mean, I mean, <laughs> like there's okay. seniority. Like you know when it's for free, and uh, if they rent it, you should put a sign up. <laughs> uh, you need a sign up, or I'm a take. Yeah, like, don't take. don't steal. Don't <laughs> yeah. take. No, but I. I also think that that's like in the Hispanic community. Like, uh, dude, I wanted that. I wanted to say yeah, that, I but I wanted to be like, like, like yo, if, if, if there's some for the people, I can talk about it. I can talk about it. Mi raza, mi raza, mi raza. Y'all, y'all know where I'm talking hey, about. Where are you from, man? Well, my parents <laughs> are. Text, text Stacy. Text Stacy. Be like, do do uh, you guys have the same problem with uh, a centerpiece theft as the <laughs> Hispanic people do? do I think it's I think it's our our community. Yeah, I know. I know. I just didn't want to say that. <laughs> and it's dumb too Like why keep them like Where do you put them well, at I mean Like for quinceañeras Okay look well The one in the image is ridiculous But there's some that just like flower vases like Yeah that but one? Where, what is this guy gonna do with it Is know, he that, gonna put it in his office that, Is he gonna put it in the entrance dumb. of his house yeah. like, In the middle of the table You put, a, put a, a stand next to the door <laughs> Yeah I'm saying Because my family My family does this type of shit no, we, like, we What can, the fuck you gonna do with we, it We could put one right here Have pretty flowers every time And then it has like the wedding name Like the people The couple <laughs> yeah, well, she said, "I don't think so." Damn, it is an us problem. I no, it's definitely yeah. an us problem. I can probably say that it is it's an us <laughs> so problem, th- and it, it, it goes for a good wedding because sometimes there's fights over these fucking yeah, dude, for so real. <laughs> I take pride in this shit. So I guess my question is: Is this 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 issue come up because of people taking and demanding to have a centerpiece, like like? No, they have to give us a centerpiece. Like they, it's a custom that a centerpiece is giving to the guests. Oh, because or like ours, just- at ours, it wasn't like people were fucking upset. Like one of the comments was it, well, you should have gave us the centerpiece. Like I was gonna put that, but the the flowers, <laughs> the, the flowers. People knew that the flowers were were real, and it's like, oh, we're not asking for the flowers. Like they're gonna fucking die. Like yeah, same thing. Like the fucking vase. Like where are you gonna put the vase? I think with the flowers, you're gonna keep the flowers. They're gonna look nice in your house, but they're gonna fucking die. Yeah, gonna die I, I think it's, I think it's more of a memento. Like like I got this from their wedding, you know, because yeah. that's the only real thing you get to actually. But keep. but but I also think that our culture doesn't do presents like other cultures. Like I've gone to uh, other other uh, uh, other race, yeah, and they'll have like a a, a bottle opener or a, a mm-hmm. koozie, or I've seen like chanclas that says like the date. And the time well, and to who be, got to, married. To be real, all right, look, one thing about our community is also like the actual giving to the couples and stuff isn't as big as other cultures. All right? That's also true. In other cultures, like like the, the people make enough money to pay for the wedding itself. All right? Like motherfuckers, Ooh, literally right. Hispanic people invite the world 
and they don't they, they get free food they go enjoy the party and they don't really give shit you know which yeah. is it's fucked up they have less i get it I think I think for every every uh, black dollar, the white people have seven dollars. So, so I get I, it. I helped my I helped my sister for my um, for her fifteen, and there was one I'm not gonna say her name, but it rhymes with. I've been throwing people. Daddy, guessing, 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 guessing. I'm not gonna say this. Say, 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 just a random, random Hispanic lady name. Ah, that's no, because he fucking knows my answer. He's either gonna get it one or two. So either he gets uh, it right I or forgot. he gets it wrong. <laughs> he actually well, knows one. <laughs> well, whatever. So uh, they gave, fuck, they gave like like a, they gave us. They helped us out. Like it, it was we we needed every fucking dollar that we can get, right? Yeah. But she was like, "Yeah, um, you you should go and and for the toast, you should say like the name of the person and how much they gave." I was like. Bet you would be last on the list for us to give us things. Like, if you make us, like, on time, yeah. like, ah, well, we'll run out of time. Like, we're not going to say your name. Like, yeah. she wanted recognition on that shit. And I was like, no, mamas, there's other people giving, like, three times as much as you. And, and you they're not related to us. And you're over yeah. here fucking crying and bitching and moaning over this shit because yeah, you want the recognition. That, 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 that's a bit extreme. That's insane. Yeah, I was like, you're an idiot, bro. Yeah. I will give a shout out I to the like person that. that gives the most. <laughs> <laughs> Gladly. <laughs> Gladly. Like, you can come up and give <laughs> you, a you speech. You can give a whole speech. <laughs> Sponsor. We start the beat yeah. right now. <laughs> the bit. Yeah, that, that's why, honestly, um, I, I liked my friend Brian's his wedding. Like It oh, was yeah. like really small, no children. It was like super, super small, and they saved money. And they, we, I, I had a blast. <laughs> so uh, at work, we just, uh, we were talking to one of the, uh, the HVAC contractors, and I, I want to say he was Vietnamese or Philippine or I don't know. He was Asian. Yeah, I'm not gonna like. I don't want to butcher it and say where it was or whatever. That's um, fine. But he said whenever they have their like weddings, that people like fucking buy in or give money because they 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 want to give money to the couple that's getting married because they're they're about to start their life. Yeah. You know. So like instead of. They buy their invitation to fucking get in. Yeah. So I think it's fucking crazy. Which is fair because yeah. I think I think whenever, you know, like I think. I had so many people at, uh, at my wedding. It would have been a fucking like 20 people wedding if, <laughs> if people I were think, to give money and shit for the wedding. I had a friend married in like the, the Houston, like the aquarium, like the upstairs in the aquarium. It was fucking awesome, dope. But to get an extra plate was $100 per person. All right, like the food ain't cheap. I was like, and you're not gonna give a, a gift close to the food you're gonna fucking eat. Like, I'm sorry, but we gotta start fucking shaming. Uh, Let's start fucking dude, shaming. Esteban's no, gonna fucking everyone. clip this. I'm, I'm a, Esteban's gonna get me murdered. <laughs> we should yes. clip it. We, we, we give should, money to them. We should start giving more for people that are getting married. After Danny's wedding, ah, yeah. <laughs> I'm all hyped. I'm like, yeah, give give them more money. We'll have that recognition after Danny's wedding, and he'll yeah. give us the experience of what he felt, and oh, then we'll start but, changing. But, but, look, but look at this, look at this, look, groomsmen. All right, we're we're in the party, bro. We don't have to worry about that. That's yeah, like the VIP. The, yeah, we're VIP. That's yeah, cool. we can. We we have a for sure centerpiece hey, in our name. I went to Rick and I said, "Would you be my groomsman?" He was like. Ah. Fuck it, I guess so. <laughs> Don't even say that. He's like, I've only met you like a handful yeah, of times. Like, we only went fishing once. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. I went fishing with the other one at least three times. That is true. Yeah, I, uh, I feel bad for the, the yeah. guy that fucked Goliath. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good. Thing. Watch the other episodes to get context. Uh, Look, we, 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 there was a, there was another conversation you wanted to have after this. What was it? No, I I, I think it was the uh, we started. The episode that it's freezing, Houston, oh, yellow yeah. groin. Uh, prayers up to everybody that's involved that have busted busted pipe. Uh, maybe their heaters ain't working. People that are shelter. Yeah, but we came out here and we decided to pot. Yeah, and uh, man, it's it's cold. Did do you, did y'all have anything to share about uh, this last winter storm? Well, the one that happened before this one actually uh-huh. fucked up the pipes in <laughs> in this, in this room. building. Huh? I did it. Yeah, so that that really sucked. And the thing was, I was sleeping in the main house because this one doesn't have central heating. So whenever I sleep over there, I have my little space heater. But since I was over there enjoying like the actual like central heating, uh, I didn't realize these were busted till like a couple of days later. So whenever I would walk on the front grass, it would be like. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, it's just fucking nice. Yeah, I, I was like, what is going on? Why is it so? And then I went back. And I was like, I noticed the pipes were freaking like busted. 
<laughs> that fucking it was just sucked. <laughs> yeah, that wow. sucked. Yeah, but you know, um, it happened. We we got everything repaired, and it wasn't too 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 bad. So this one this one wasn't as bad. I yeah. Think so. um, I Knock th- on wood, we're, we're we're still living it. Y'all y'all see the the podcast drops on Friday, right? But yeah. we usually tend to record earlier in the week. Um, I got to drive to work tomorrow. Yeah, and, but hey, believe it or not, a lot of a lot of companies uh, shut down. Well, Monday was MLK. OK, yeah, right. and then Tuesday, uh, a lot of companies were shut down because they're like, yeah, hey, and, and if you if you worked Monday, your your company's racist. The other thing is that there was rain and stuff. There was slight rain, so that's what caused a lot of uh, like in bridges, like yeah, ice well, and stuff like well, that. It, it was like the flurries, bro. It was like literally like 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 miniature snow, yeah. and that's what got me sick when we were in in mm-hmm. the mountains in the and mountains. shit. You weren't there, but yeah, it was in yeah, your, I Yosemite. I was here. I was actually yeah. podcasting <laughs> that day, but yeah, what'd you talk about? Nothing. Nothing. He missed I was, us. He was waiting for us. I was role playing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was, I was Daddy. I was Oscar. Wah, wah, wah. Was like, <laughs> that was Danny. I was to side <laughs> Danny. Tisai, I, f- Danny. I feel yeah. like a very educated and well respected family. That's I mean, awesome. man, and and must be nice. The Velasquez, <laughs> and the Velasquez feels like and the Velasquez family. <laughs> Let's go, bro. Puta you you do this all the fucking time, pinche <laughs> Richard. Uh, like, bien donado. Richard Richardson. No, bien donado. No, because bien donado. Yeah, because well, well yeah, mal donado is bad, bad, bad donation. Yeah. Yeah. Loser. <laughs> <laughs> did, did y'all, did y'all uh, power go out the last time? Uh, it was just a scheduled one, like, but for the most part, no. Yeah, no. mine just went out for like four or five hours during the actual during the day, not during the night. No, our, ours was out for like fucking... Two or three days and There's shit. And we, 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 slept, yeah. we slept at my suegros and his was fucking out too. And we had to get like the fucking generator and put the heater for a little bit. And yeah, it was the last time it was, it was, it was. Well, the last time, worse. yeah. They, I mean, the, the, the whole, what was it? The air power god grid, power yeah. grid went down. And I think there was a couple, like almost like a hundred deaths. Yeah, people died. And Did this one, I mean, it, it is bad. It was pretty cold, but it didn't like. I don't think we did. We see snow on the grass. I didn't see snow. Yeah, on the no, grass. I, 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 like I, 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 like it stayed. Like on, a, on, it stayed no. On well, I, uh, not a mo- like there was some floating on. There the was air. a lot of accidents. Yeah, yeah. 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 The, I think yeah. by Sugar Land, like both lanes were iced up, and yeah, I think it was some water on. Or no, I think it was I ten. It, it was like a major freeway. The eighteen oh, wheeler oh, flipped oh, over. On Katie, oh, yeah, one. I have the 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 image on the actual. Do do? Yeah, go on to the main Let's the main folder. Yeah. On the right, <laughs> no. What, what's that? No, that's not it. That's that's another guru pit. We'll talk about it later. That one right there. Oh, that's the one. Yeah, I actually passed by that uh, that accident on the way to podcast. Oh, when you were hiking over here. Yeah, I uh, we usually pause podcast on Monday. Yeah, and I was on the freeway since Sunday and shit. Like, <laughs> damn, I know traffic's gonna be bad. <laughs> like, let me go the day before. <laughs> I'll just sleep over there in the room. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. And then you go on to the left. That's that's the the ad we made. Oh, this one. Yeah, yeah. Talking about how cold it is. Yeah, it's too damn cold. Yeah. <laughs> ABC, ABC thirteen. If you want to sponsor this podcast, yeah, hit us up. Yeah, we well, do say news news too, as you can see. We are. We're probably more important news anchors than most. It's it's completely um, without so, bias, right? Is that right? Super bias. <laughs> we're super <laughs> biased. Super biased. Okay, we're, well, super, well, we're honest about their bias. We're, we're super biased. Speak for yourself. Yeah. Oh, oh, well, he was defending. Yeah, that was like defending child, anybody. Child predator. <laughs> there is. Like, I learned about gravity. Yeah. I was Stephen de- Hawking. Yeah. I wasn't defending anybody. He's, he's not like he's not like Alien versus Predator is my favorite movie because he, he roots for the Predator. He said it was a conspiracy. <laughs> he said it was a conspiracy. There was aliens involved. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it all comes around full circle. Oh. Ah, goes, but uh, so y'all were fine this winter, like this this winter, this two days. I'm in the sweater. Yeah, yeah. Nah, we were, I was fine too. The 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 last time, uh, or the last Arctic blast, or whatever you call it, um, like I said, we didn't we didn't have power for a couple of days, and uh, a family friend let us borrow a, a generator, and they lived in Umbo, and we lived like over here in like Central City, and my suegro was like, okay, let's go. Like, All right, cool. I'll go with you. You want to drive? He said, like, yeah. So we took his truck. Tell me why. We go through where Bellway 8 is at and 90, and you can clearly fucking see that there's ice under the fucking freeway. And Lepiso, and I'm like, what are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? 
So we lost, we like lost control and yeah. fucking hit the median and shit. And we, we, his tire popped like, oh wow, on his fucking spot. And I was like, dude, you see that it's fucking shiny. <laughs> Turn the fucking other. I I know we don't we don't go through this often, but it's fucking common sense. Like, the sun wasn't hitting underneath the 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 bellway or, or freeway ninety, so underneath didn't give it fucking time. Just, yeah, it's thought. Yeah, so you can see yeah. that there's a fucking layer, and he's like, "Okay," and he was turning. He let me on. He's like, <laughs> "What do I do?" And I was like, "Dude, what the fuck you doing? <laughs> like, what are you doing?" I, I think I scared him too, but yeah, ah, man, it was very you, upsetting. You, you're, not, you're not supposed to like hit the brakes. You're supposed to let it try to catch traction some way. Right, 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 but don't fucking go in there pushing fucking gas. Like, yeah. his turn could have been like on the on on the sunny side. And and not fucking like floored it, but be like, okay, just yeah. slowly, just yeah. tap it, just tap it. You know you're about to go through there. You know. The sucky part was we were trying to fucking change the tire, and the shit was like, uh, like said Maro, so we couldn't get it down. We couldn't get it down. We had to yeah. call a fucking tow truck, and it it's fucking freezing. It's freezing. It's it's like fucking twenty something. I'm like, this fucking sucks. Oh, because like he's at like he's at uh, uh, Pisar, you know. Yeah. You wanted to fucking press the gas. Yo, I, I was so fucking mad. I I, I went out on that day because I think the movie theaters were open and I went on a date. And on the way back, like it was, I took uh like the the ninety the feeder. Mm-hmm. It was I I think it happened when I saw the Mustang, mm-hmm. like the left back tire hit ice, and I was I was spinning out and it was fucking scary. But I did not hit anything, and I was like, yeah. <laughs> she was all scared. I'm like, uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no that. Yeah, it, it's fucking scary. We're not used to it, you know. Yeah, I I, I saw a meme that was like, "Y'all motherfuckers can't drive when it's sunny." <laughs> it's like, stay home. Yeah, yeah. They're all like, "This this this, this <laughs> isn't that liability like insurance weather. <laughs> this is the full coverage, boys." <laughs> yeah. So. Do, y- do y'all think we'll have another one this year? Every year going forward. No, 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 I'm saying another one like, this year, like, like oh, this, this, season, this season, this season. No, huh? maybe not. I don't think so. Probably not. And this shit hit well, fucking. Well, there was a lot of football games. Ja- there was a lot of football games that got canceled. This shit. January and February are the coldest. Yeah, so I mean it could, knows? but uh, who knows? There was a lot of games that maybe. fucking got canceled that that were like really bad because of the fucking snow, like bad, bad. Like they were trying to figure out how to. What, what, was was Taylor Swift's boyfriend okay? No, but it was that game. <laughs> like, it, it, it was like. It, I think the temperature was like negative 10, 15 or some shit like that. Like Jesus. Something I ha- crazy. I, I have a question before we call it quits for the night. So I'm not married yet, but I'm proposed. Is it weird? Proposed like she proposed to you. Because <laughs> <laughs> the ring came in already? Yeah. From she, 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 from <laughs> Timo. Uh, honestly, it got delayed, I think, because of the weather. That's what she told me. But <laughs> <laughs> did you wear a ring before you, like before the official marriage day or or i don't know if it's right or wrong but i did you did i did wow that's like 20 years of bad luck i did but it was like to tell girls that i was off the market no, i'm just kidding were you, were you no, i was doing it i, I was doing it <laughs> I, I was i was doing it because I, I had never fucking wore rings like it wasn't something that i was accustomed to right, I, yeah. and yeah. i even put it on the fucking wrong hand until my my wait it goes on the left hand the left hand mm-hmm. left I, hand I, this one, because it's supposed to be that. There's something about this nerve; it goes closest to the heart. But is that based off the idea that your heart's on your left hand side? That it's not it's real? the closest to the heart, regardless of whether. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I don't think it's real. I think yeah. you just accidentally I said it. <laughs> I don't know. People had extra. No, like this, so. no, your heart's not in the center. Google it. Dude, I think it's a lie. Did, did you ever watch uh, the Grinch? Remember where his heart went like really small? It was on uh, on a side. I thought you were gonna hit it with facts. I thought you that is a like fact. <laughs> what have you watched that movie? I see. Well, that. have you though? <laughs> well, okay, you, you, if your heart grows three sides, you got to fucking run to the hospital. That's oh. dangerous. Speaking, uh, it's we can say speaking of expanded hearts or no, what? I, <laughs> I just watched the movie where where they they used that as a reference, or the guy was going through it, but I don't want to say the name because it, it's gonna whatever. What the, the fuck heart just the, happened? The, All right, the look, we, we gotta we gotta say bye. We gotta say bye. We gotta say bye. <laughs> so do I wear it or do I not? When I get it, well, I think I, 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 look, I, I did look, it as to, practice to get, to, get, to get used to it. But I think we should ask ChatGPT well, his bad luck. Hold on, hold on. I didn't use the one that I was gonna get married to. I had like a little. Uh, 
like the sports one, like a plastic one. Oh, that yeah, but it's, it's, wait, but it's still shit. technically a wedding band. I think you should just get like a regular man ring. No, because the other one, this one, I the one that what. I wear gets blessed and everything at the ceremony. Right. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. It's supposed to arrive this week. I'll bring it next week. And, and we'll, then we'll you, talk you about it. And maybe even, I wear it here. You can't even see the bride before the wedding. What makes you think that you can wear a ring months in advance? Let's see. Like you want to let girls know that you're off the well, market. Let's see. If people want to know what we are going to decide, I'll bring it next Monday. Yeah. And I'll bring the ring, and I'll either put it on or not here. Or the or they can vote on the comments. Uh, oh yeah! Tell us in think? the comments. We'll settle this on the next episode of the Qualifying Guru Spot. If you're still here, thank you for watching. Peace out. out.